One of our key aims through Advance Queensland is to foster greater collaboration between government and tech startups and SMEs. The TWIG program is a great step forward along the road to greater collaboration, offering government an innovative way to work with and support business. And it was really interesting talking to the um, successful applicants who have had their 12-week program. And what was interesting to me was uh, their energy is that they've come out of government and they're more energised rather than less. They can see the opportunity that's within there. And I suspect that those people within government that worked with them are feeling the same way. TWIG has been developed to provide our SMEs with the opportunity to work collaboratively with a large customer, in this case government, and uh, they have had the opportunity to refine their product offerings and their delivery approach for both government and large corporate markets. Alexa, ask Queensland Government, what's the surf like on the Gold Coast? The wave height on the Gold Coast is currently 0 0.7 metres. Not exactly great for surfing today. Perhaps you hire a stand-up paddleboard. May I suggest the Sunshine Coast for surfing as the waves at Caloundra are 1.6 metres at the moment. So particularly when dealing with the somewhat obscure practices of procurement um, in government departments, they can be a little bit opaque, it can be a bit confusing for us. So we were really excited uh, when we saw that the TWIG program was happening um, and we got the opportunity to actually work with the city on this because it broke down a lot of those procurement barriers that we would normally go through. Future versions of the app will include more advanced functions such as deriving failed signal location based on nearest successful signal collection point. My advice to future applicants would be, you know, be bold, be creative, and don't be afraid to ask questions or put forward crazy sounding solutions. And certainly don't expect your experience to be like any that you've had with government at any level, ever. Uh, because I think Victor and I will both uh, agree on this one. Twig was different, but easily the, uh, the best experience we have had working with government at any level. It was a positive experience. Anyone who is considering um, being part of the Twig program, highly recommend it. We also had to leverage the Twig team to overcome cultural differences between our two organisations. So to establish a common language and build relationships so we can move along more quickly. But one of the great things that actually came out of this was the innovative technology that we've actually used and also exposing our staff to new ways of working, the Trello boards. So we were able to move along with this problem at pace over 12 weeks to actually resolve a good outcome. So Carbon Editor is a cloud-based supported writing environment which allows for the creation, editing, review and publication of correspondence and documents from a single controlled environment. Um, from our perspective, applying for a future Twig engagement should be seriously considered uh, by any solution provider who thinks that their product you know, could work within a government context. Tom was an invaluable interpreter. Um, his, his experience with government before the program had started had obviously given him the contacts within the government and he knew the personalities and he knew the people. So it was very easy for us then to uh, ask of Tom, okay, well, how do we get this done? And then Tom can, you know, act it as the, 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 the real conduit. So it was really invaluable. And I say this here, not just for the SMEs in the room, but for all government agencies that are represented here today. We have got to find new ways to be able to solve problems and solve problems that uh, don't just benefit government but benefit our SMEs in this state because that is where the greatest job growth is going to be into the future. We absolutely do want other um, government agencies to participate with us in the next round early in the new year. Can you imagine if there are four challenges per agency, so we have 80 to 100 challenges going out just after Christmas for Queensland-based SMEs and startups? You know, that would be incredibly powerful. Now, I've just shot the team down here because <laughs> they're worried we're going to have to manage that. But honestly, I would rather we're faced with the problem of having to manage demand in that way and that we're giving opportunities for SMEs and startups here in Queensland to grow jobs um, than the other way around. So um, we'll resource it to make it happen, and that's my commitment. That due to the great success of the first round, a second round of the TWIG program will be launched in the new year.